Hey, this is Forrest Griffin, and you're watching All In Magazine, which is ironic because you can't actually watch a magazine, and yet you are. That's so meta. Tonight, we're out at the Voodoo Zip Line at the Rio for an event called Share a Chair. And the proceeds from this event are going to go to the One Step Closer Foundation. And then we've earmarked everything happening tonight to go to Shriners Hospital for Children in Houston. Jacob Zalewski, who founded the One Step Closer Foundation, is actually a student of mine. I was his professor back in college. And he came to me and said, I, you know, I've got cerebral palsy, but there are people who have it worse than me. And I'm actually kind of blessed with my situation. And what I want to do is help people who are worse off than I am. We're raising $10,000 for kids uh, who need wheelchairs and get people who are financially unable to get wheelchairs and prolong their lives. So this event will do that. I've known him for years and we've always wanted to benefit him and his charity and this was a great opportunity to do so. I can't help but notice you have a lot of people that have shown up. Who are some of your special guests out here? We've got some UFC guys. We've got Forrest Griffin here, uh, Mike Pyle, okay. Stacey Fusion, WWE's Alicia Webb is one of my best friends, some poker players, our donors. It's been a hot minute. I'm glad, good to see you. I mean, I remember you from that time seven years ago when we met. You had ridiculous hair. I did have ridiculous hair. You're looking better. Yeah, actually. thank you. Your face is looking a lot better. Yeah. <laughs> tell, me, tell me a little bit about your kind of perception of it as it kicks off here. People are going to pay money to fall to their death with me, and that money is going to end up going to the Shriners Hospital to buy wheelchairs for kids with muscular dystrophy. And right now we're kind of hanging out and people are deciding whether they want to ride the zip line before they have a full stomach or they want to eat some, relax yeah. a little, and then ride the zip line. If you are afraid of heights or maybe have motion sickness, you probably shouldn't eat too much and save the eating for after the zip line. That's a great serious yeah. answer. <laughs> So you got a two-seated contraption, you're going to ride tandem, they'll strap you in at your waist. You're going to go 33 miles per hour down, 20 miles per hour back. At a high speed, you're about 500 feet in the air. Did I ever mention I was terrified of heights? The folks at the zip line were really nice and said, you know, you've got your poker tournament happening tomorrow, our, our raising the stakes for CP poker tournament. And they said, can we figure out some way to partner things together? So we kind of set this up rather quickly and I'm, I'm glad it's coming together. Why is doing stuff like this so important oh, to you? You know, even the minor, minor Z-level celebrity I have can bring a little money to somebody that's gotten a shitty hand. It's the least I can do, literally the least I can do, and be terrified for six or seven minutes <laughs> to make some money for charity. It's just been an unbelievable event, and I'm very humbled and excited to be a part of it. I really want to thank everybody who came out here tonight and supported this great cause, and everybody knows that their money is going straight to the people who need it most. Yeah.